Hello everybody, my name is Altarn and this is a let's play of Galactic Civilizations 2 Twilight of the Honor. We're at war with the Korgoth. Um, they're trying to do nasty things. They're trying to sneak by us by going into this part of space which we have no sight and vision on. And I think I really need to take that s way more serious than I am. So I'm gonna move some of my fleets to make sure they don't can't pass unnoticed. I'm also gonna build another scout ship and for that we're gonna pick a planet which has um, a long production queue. Let's see, scout ship, scout ship, scout ship, peaker. Actually, actually, let's see if we can upgrade him. That would be a good idea actually, put some decent engines on him. Yeah, I like that idea. And the Hulk, what am I gonna do with Hulk? I'm gonna obsolete you. No, you're not gonna be destroyed. Same with the uh, Hulk 2, which was designed for a very different purpose, which purpose just surrendered. And um, transport warp 7. Oh, yeah, I definitely should look into it. Oh, oh, bugger. That's not good. Hey, wax. Wait a second. Already got a scout ship. A bad one. Let's just get rid of that one, too. And. My s uh, no no uh. We'll just get rid of you as well. And Ah there we go. Sup with Right, that's it. Alright. That's upgrade. Let's see if we can um put some decent engines underneath here. Size twelve. It's just a little bigger than the old one. Excellent. Speed of four. That's without bonuses, I believe. Which we do have. Now let's put some uh, sensor rays on it. And let's not forget about life support. Oh yeah. Let's see. Ah, oh, looks like we'll be able to fit it out just nicely. Excellent. And a general life support. It's the best I can do right now. It's awfully big though. So let's just uh, stuff that on the belly. There we go. Life's range. Two sectors. And can I fit on a weapon? I can't. Alright, so we'll go for more um, life support, I suppose. Where are you? There you are. Right, completely maxed out. Good range. Better speed. A little bit more cost, but that's okay. I can handle that. So, you are sub with three. Mm, actually, I'm very tempted to go to do this. Um, let's just um, obsolete this design. No, I don't want to scrape that. And um, Actually, I'm going to wait out warp three, because I think that one's the same size as my, pre as my impulse drive. That way I can be sure that we're able to fit on it the same amount of guns. So, let's put a co one of our colonies to work. And Hizen can build me a... Where are you? Yell if you spot it! Sop with three. There we go. Two weeks. Yeah, perfect. Who else, who else is not doing anything? Antares is not building anything. We just build a... Ooh, no wonder it's not building anything. Never mind. Okay. Oh wow. Yeah. Let's um. That's more than enough fleets, right? Um, just go there. And you two, just uh, head over there. God, it's gonna take them ages. How many turns? Six. Blech. Yeah, should have, should have upgraded that. Definitely. Alrighty. And a new wave is already approaching. Yeah, this um No, no, I'm gonna wait for one week. I can wait one week. I am that patient. Okay. Let's see. Yes, awesome. Let's just keep going. Two weeks for <laughs> two weeks for warp drive too. Damn it! I'm never gonna rebuild my ship this way. This is um one of my um that once uh, 
Uh, you basically have constantly have new technology coming out which will improve your ship. So you you're always very te oh look at that very tempted to um, wait for with upgrading. Hmm. You end up not upgrading ever. But some very de some decent propulsion would actually benefit my fleet a lot because my opponent is just far far away. And when I th thinking about it, three is overdoing it. But they might send a warship fleet here. I don't know. Okay, so we have some ships available here, and we have ships there. So we're just going to send them here, and we're going to wait for transport because I don't want my transport to get blown up. First, we're going to see if we can win this uh, little battle. How well did we do? No soldiers. Ah, we took down a lot more of their HP than they did theirs. What else am I gonna do? Yeah, they're dead. And I lost a single ship. I'm okay with that. Let's see. Oh, awesome! Woo. They're not kidding, are they? Wow! Okie dokie. Now I guess I know where you guys are gonna go. You're gonna go over there. Actually, probably there is a pretty good idea. Let's intercept them. And... Mm, no, they're too far out of range. I was thinking about going up, uh, letting these two join up. Ah, uh, that's not gonna happen. So let's um, send you over there. And to be honest, if I manage to knock off all these ships, I'd be amazed if they uh, have more. Righty, let's see. Hulk, just a Hulk. Where's my scout ship? Still two weeks away. Guess I'll have to use the turn button. Wait a second. No, he's right over there. That's actually the second one being built. That's um, okay, I guess. So I'm just gonna put him here and the second one over here. That should cover our borders rather well. And another little detail. Where's my. Where is my flagship? Terran flagship, that's a T, so you go all the way down, just look at the Whoa. That's plenty of ships. Terran Alliance flagship. Oh, it's already running out of survey. Excellent. That was anomalies again, I wasn't sure it was still running around. Like I said, it's been a couple of days. Um, right, um... I think I pretty much set everything in motion. No, I didn't. Let's just, um, send you over here. So they don't try and go around the other side and here's another software 3 you're moving there okay that's good here's in one week so that's pretty much now oh wow oh wow I was not expecting that took out their entire fleet well let's see if our locks keep running let's see oh Don't mess with the Terrans, poor boys. Don't mess with them. <laughs> yeah, we're uh, we're uh, just two of our ships pretty much outgun them. And they're really making a move. They are. They're not kidding. They want. They want to really try something over here. Well, I have got some news for you guys. That is just not going to happen. Because these two are gonna move, <laughs> and then there's these guys waiting for him. Mm, yeah, I think I've got my back covered. So, do I have another scout ship yet? Hisen. Yes, good old Hisen. So, here, I'm just gonna uncover that fog of war. Brilliant. 
And let's see. Oh. Attack 6, 10, defense 14. Yeah, it's just their total lack of defense is, is really hurting them. Oh no! My own damn fault. Should I'm, I'm not even paying attention properly. And then that happens. Yeah, I shouldn't be surprised at that really. And I <laughs> actually have all my flight carriers still running around here. And I guess it be that. Wow, you're kidding me. No way. Ah, light fighters. Heavy fighters, even. Just a single ship? There we go. You did well. You did well. What was your time? Speaking of time... Let's see. Um, th I think I actually will have leave him spread instead of um. But I am gonna take the attack initiative. Oh, against three. Yeah, dead. And I'll take the initiative again. And they're dead. There we go. Now that really should have hurt them a lot, to be honest. And. Yeah, I lost my scout ship here, so I have no idea where they are, but my guess is they're around. And my new, uh, new and improved scout ship should be there any second now. What's this? Constructors from the Thalons. What are you guys planning? I bet I'm not going to like it. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to like it. Um, probably going to try and influence bomb me. Me? No. Let's see. Cordelia, Hizen, Cairo, and Earth. And a new design is available. I don't really care about that. Alright. You guys can just wait here. You guys can actually go move forward because I want to catch them. And I want to assault some planets. I'm rather tired of um, wiping them out just one fleet at a time. Okay, good. We have a new fleet of hulks. Actually, I could go for a fleet of four. Might as well, I guess. And another scout ship. Okay, well, excellent. So, we'll put you over there. Now I've got their entire territory covered, and I think that's enough scout ships. Alright. Let's do the obsolete rounds. There we go. And... Yeah, that works for me. Righty. Ah, oh god, I love my scout ships. Look at that. Nothing is going to get by him. So we're just going to move him like this. And that way we're going to uncover any area. Uh, pretty much going to cover their f whatever fleet they've sent in that tor territory. And instead of uh, waiting for them, we're going to hunt them down and kill them. And this is a fleet of four. So this is pretty much a heavy assault fleet. You're there going to there, go there. And... Um, crack some skulls, yeah. And I'm gonna be brave and I'm gonna send in um, some troop transports as well. I want this war to be over with quickly. Now, um, they're not gonna, they can't win. They just can't. Not unless there someone else takes offense and decides that um, they don't want the Korgoth to die out, I guess. That happens. Um, oh, look at that. We actually found them. I was hoping that would happen. Can't move there though. So probably best to just stay put. Let's see what happens. The alarm goes off. Well, I was waiting for that to be honest. So, with that out of the way, we have just picked up hybrid warp as a research possibility. I'm not going to do that. It's going to take way too much time. I want to research something else by now. So, um, thank you for watching. My name is Altar, and this was the Let's Play of Galactic Civilization 2 Twilight of the Honor, and goodbye for now.